This is a First Coast News special report. Good evening. Well, unfortunately, it's happening. If you've been with us, do you remember we talked about that even if you're not getting the information from the hurricane recon, that just by looking at an infrared satellite picture, and that's what this is, that you would start to see the pinhole eye. Do you see it? Right there. And sure enough, we happen to have the recon as well, and recon is showing pressure down to 965 millibars. And generally, um, even if we don't have recon and don't have the satellite, if we know the pressure is getting down to about 960 millibars, that supports a Category 3. And look at the winds up to 105. It's moving just east of due north. Everything else with the forecast remains the same. And unfortunately, uh, now it's a given. This may be a Category 3 by 11 o'clock tonight, which is bad news because this will continue to intensify until it makes landfall. So I think it's just about a guarantee it will make landfall as a Category 3. Here's the motion. Our forecast for all of Northeast Florida and Southeastern Georgia has not changed. We'll keep you updated.